Hey everyone, it's technology expert Burton Kelsel with Integral here, sharing another tech tip to help you get the most out of the technology in your life. Today we're going to talk about Skyview, a great app that allows you to view the stars without the help of a telescope. This app unfortunately is only available for iOS devices, but it allows you to point your smartphone or your tablet towards the stars. You can view distant stars, you can view constellations in the sky, you can also view planets as well. Let's take a look at sky view and see what you're missing out as far as viewing the stars. Sky view is a great app made by Terminal 11. Uh, it is available for Apple devices and it looks like they finally have it available for Android devices as well. Anyway, this app allows you to view the planets, stars, constellations, and even satellites in the sky. Uh, as you can see from their website, you don't need a Wi-Fi connection to use, only your, your cellular connection. Uh, it allows you to use an augmented reality where either A, you can have an overlay that allows you to view the stars, or you can point directly up to the sky and see what you're looking at in the sky. The great thing about this app too is that it'll automatically update itself. And using it myself, it doesn't really um, interfere with your phone usage and not much changes in the updates as other than planetary bodies. But like I said, it's pretty simple. You just point it up to the sky and you can see, you can see whatever you need to see or want to see in the sky. Um, you can also glance at uh, constellations and find out what constellations you look at. They also give you different information about the stars that you're looking at as well. But it's a very, very helpful app for those who miss looking through the telescope and seeing what's going on up in the stars. If we look here, you can kind of see what options you have. You can see part of what's I think Taurus constellation in sky view. Um, the great thing too, you can tell it, you can customize what you see in the sky. You can tell it if you only want to see planetary bodies. You can tell it if you want to see constellations. Uh, you can also tell it if you only want to see um, objects like the Hubble telescope. And you can also use night mode which will preserve your night vision when looking up in the sky. A lot of smartphones will generate a lot of backlight, which makes it difficult looking at dark uh, objects. But if you turn on the night mode, you can preserve your own night vision and you can gaze up at the stars while looking at the app for sky view to identify the different constellations. But as the picture here shows on their website, it's pretty simple. You download the app, you grab your iOS device, and you head outside preferably at night and you can gaze and see what's going on. But you could also gaze up into the sky during the daytime as this couple is doing and see what's overhead. I think one of the interesting things that I like about sky view is that um, I can see where different um, planets are in the sky at certain times of the year. If there's a constellation that I'm confused about, I can use sky view to take a look and see what's going on. The other thing that you might want to check out by Terminal 11 is their satellite guide, which basically is an app where you can track the 17,000 plus satellites that are orbiting the Earth. So if you're curious about what's spying on you or who's spying on you, you can download this great app, Skyview Satellite Guide, and see what satellites are rotating the Earth and maybe who is spying on you. So a pretty interesting app to check out and check out Skyview because I think it's a great app that you can use to view the stars. As always, if you've got comments or questions, leave them in the comments section below. Check out more great tech tip videos like this on our Facebook page, or our YouTube channel rather, at Integral Onsite and Online Tech Support. Uh, we're all over social media too. That's where the Facebook part comes in. So check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Pinterest. And as always, take care of yourselves and do many things to make you smile.
and thanks for watching.